Hello everyone and welcome to another Lens Studio tutorial. In this video we will be going over the Particle Controller template, a very simple project that I created that allows you to start and stop any particles you want when the user opens and closes their mouth. So you can go ahead and download the project by clicking the link in the description below. So in this example project, I attached the default Lens Studio Fountain particles to the user's eyes so that it looks like they're crying when they open their mouth. I also used the behavior script to enable and disable some other objects as well. So let's build this project from scratch and you can see how it works. First, what we're going to do is go into the particles template and find one of the pre-made particle resources that Lens Studio provides. We're going to right click on the fountain object and click export object, then save it to the desktop. Now we can start a new project and import our fountain. So when we have the fountain imported, we can add a head binding to the scene and attach the particles to the user's head. Then we can adjust the size and the location to make it look like it's coming out of their eyes. And then when I have it looking how I want, I'll just duplicate it and move it over to the other eye. So right now you'll see that the particles are just playing constantly and we need them to start and stop when the user opens their mouth. So we're going to need to use the particle controller script to be able to start and stop them. So once we have the script imported and added into the scene, we will need to add all the particle materials from the resources panel into the script and adjust the intensity. We will also need to make sure that we go into every particle material that we add into the script and make sure that external time is checked. This will allow the script to do its thing and start and stop the particles. Now the intensity is going to change how fast or slow the particles are moving. So now we can see the particles are starting and stopping when the user opens and closes their mouth. So we can also add some other effects here and use the behavior script to enable and disable them. So first we will add a face liquify and maybe also like a bluish color correction effect like frost. And then we will add all of those to the effects folder to make sure that they all enable and disable at the same time. And then we'll add the behavior script in the object panel by clicking add new then helper scripts and behavior. Then we'll change the trigger to face event, the event type to mouth opened, and then we'll change the response type to set enabled. And then we'll add our effect scene object that holds all of our effects. And then we can just copy this script component and paste it, change the event to mouth closed and the response to disable. Now we have a nice particle effect that the user can control themselves, allowing them to make their own custom experiences. So I hope you enjoyed this template, and if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below, and as always, please share your creations with me, I would love to check them out. So happy creating everyone!